Good Tuesday morning, everybody. Chris Allen with your weather podcast for this last day of January. It is the 31st, and it's going to be mild. In fact, we already see temperatures in the 40s this morning, and uh, that's a good sign. We're going to see temperatures actually getting into the 50s today, possibly even the low 60s as a weak cold front passes through. It'll pretty much come through unknown. It's going to set off a few clouds, but no precipitation out of that front. And it looks like February is also going to start on a mild note. Here are the numbers from yesterday. We actually started to rise in temperature overnight. So our, well, the actual high for yesterday technically happened just before midnight early this morning. 48, 46 is where we should be for this time of the year. So that's a two degree difference. 26 was our low, 27 the average low. So that's a one degree difference. So yesterday you could say a very typical late January day in southern Kentucky. With all that sunshine, it was pretty much picture perfect. One year ago, we had a high of 70. And everybody says, oh, it's so warm this winter. It's not been that warm during the last year. It was 70 degrees <laughs> in 2016 with a low of 27. Yeah, so 70 to 27, there had to be a cold front there. No precipitation over the past 24 hours. It looks like we're going to end the month of January at 46 Uh, A surplus of 69 hundredths of an inch of rain, and that's good. We're ending with a surplus. As of last year, you know, well, end of last year, we had the drought situation. The drought, by the way, is virtually gone from the entire United States. How about that? Today, for us, look for a mix of sun and clouds. We'll call it partly sunny, breezy warmer. We're going to go uh, bumped up to high to 61. I think we can achieve that or come close to it. With a southwest wind at 12, maybe to 24 at times, a little breezy during the afternoon as that front passes. Tonight, though, will be mostly cloudy, a little bit cooler with a low of 36. But for Wednesday, the first day of February, we're going to see uh, mainly cloudy skies Still relatively mild until a little bitty uh, backdoor front is going to come through and cool us down a little bit more by Wednesday night. We'll go up to 55, 55 on Wednesday and then 30 on Wednesday night. Now, Thursday for Groundhog Day, we're going to find sunshine cooler with a high of only 43, but that's only a few degrees shy of the average of 46, so not that far off as far as the numbers go. Friday, though, looks like a partly cloudy day in a chilly 40, and then down to 23 Friday night. Now, that's going to be the the, uh, coolest day out of the next seven. It's going to be Friday. But Saturday, we start to warm back up about 44, 45 Um, And clouds will be on the increase as a southern tracking system comes out of the Gulf of Mexico and the Gulf Coastal States and moves through the Boot Hill of Missouri and southern Illinois. Now, that means we will be on the east side uh, or the warmer side of that low pressure system. And because of that track, we are not looking at really any, well, little, if any, frozen precipitation out of this system. It will have a lot of moisture, so it's primarily going to be rain as we get into Saturday night, 80% chance that we're going to see rain Saturday night, and then as that system moves through Sunday, all day rain, 70% chance and a high of 50, and then once that's gone, only slightly cooler from Monday with a high of 48. So that system, if it had just tracked maybe a little bit further east of us and we would be on the west side 
of that low pressure system as it moves north, well, then we would have been in for a big time snow. Big time. But we are not. We're going to be on the warm side of the low, which means we're going to get 99% rain. Now, there could be that little brief period, maybe Saturday night, that some folks on the north or northwest side of that low could pick up a little bit of frozen precipitation, but the chances of that are pretty low. So we're highly confident here that uh, mostly what we're going to see Saturday night into Sunday is going to be rain. It's just going to be too warm. All right, that will do it for your podcast for this Tuesday morning. God bless you, and thank you as always for listening. Know the weather before it knows you. Have a great day. I'll see you live at 5.30 on AM Kentucky, 11 a.m. on midday, streaming live to the WBKO app and WBKO.com. And don't forget my radio show later today at Classic Hit Sam 100.7, in which I'll have a chance for you to win tickets to see Gallagher at Skypack. It's his final tour. It's also going to be his 70th birthday when he's here on February 9th. And, uh, you know, he's the watermelon smasher and all kinds of just impromptu comedy. So if you want to see uh, Gallagher, listen to my radio show this afternoon, especially during the what I call the drive at 5 in the 5 o'clock hour. I'm going to give somebody a chance to win tickets, not just today, but for the rest of this week. So that's at Sam 100.7 between 3 and 7 this afternoon.